Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a ridiculous Tuesday morning haul. I have the digital set of Snow and Coco and a few things that I had purchased last year. It's one of my absolute favorite collections. I'm usually like a traditionalist, but this collection made me really like doing the pastel and whatnot. So I'm just gonna get right into it. There's a good chance that my kitten's gonna get in here and start messing with everything. So I'm just gonna try to be as quick as possible. I was able to pick up the 12 by 12 and I'm not gonna lie, I almost got two. I found a bunch of them, um, but I only got one because I did order the snowflake from scrapbook.com. I'm waiting patiently, well not patiently at all. Check the mail all the time, because I want it. And I got the snowflake, so, and I still have some Merry Days from last year I didn't even use. So I don't really need this, but I, I don't know. I just love it, it's my favorite, and I figured I would pick it all up while they had it and just have some fun I'm gonna do I'm gonna go ahead and get started I'm finally ready to start my Christmas crafting my Halloween I started super late I didn't start until September 14th and I usually start at like August 1st so I definitely wanted to have at least a couple things done before November just to make myself feel better but I was able to pick up the 12 by 12 paper pad and you can see everything on the front but I'll do a quick flip through I love the color palette in this collection it is so cute this is probably one of my favorite papers I also have the six by six I picked up last year and haven't busted into yet but like I said I also have the digital collection so I'll be able to print and cut some ephemera into tiny little pieces and use some of the little ephemera bits and stuff from the digital collection to make as cards and whatever I was able to pick up the washi I really think it's cute. It's got one wide one with the trees. I love the black and white. It's got a gold glitter. That's $3.99. Obviously, everybody shops. I did pick up the cards. Honestly, I might return these, though. I don't... I usually hand make cards, and I was like, oh, I'll embellish these. But really, these ones are going to be the only ones that you can, like, embellish yourself. So I might actually return those. I got some of the little trees, and my plan is to make... And if you hear noises, that's my kitten playing in his box and I much rather him play in his box than mess with all my stuff so I'm just gonna let it go but that's what's happening there in the background these are $2.99 and I have an idea for these I'll do a project share when I finish my ornament but I have some of the Tim Holtz little deer from last year and I think I'm gonna use these to make an ornament so I'll follow up with that I did get one set of the stamps I tend to buy stamps and then not use them so I didn't want to go nuts on buying the stamps until I actually created something with them I love this bird though this bird gets me it's just oh my heart I love this little tiny bird it's my favorite piece from the whole collection it's got a little scarf it's cold and I just love it so I'm gonna wait until I actually use these and see what I do with them before I purchase another set of cards and interesting little fact I found these on clearance they must have been left over from last year so I found these on clearance at one Tuesday morning so they were 20% off so it was a dollar 19 same exact bags but then I saw that they got them again this year so I went ahead and picked up some because I think it would be cute to do a snow and cocoa bag topper and include you know a matching bag so that's that I wasn't gonna pick up any of these tags but I have a little uh, project in mind that I think these would be great as little goodies um, I'm seeing the tags and the tassels everywhere this was everywhere and I had to go to a few Tuesday mornings to find all this stuff but the tags and the little pom-poms and the big pom-poms actually I've seen everywhere but I will be doing project shares and show you guys what I do with all this stuff but these are just little tags and they had a couple sets like one of the sets was red um, based and they had one more set so I think they had four sets of tags all the tags were $1.99 and you get 12 tags in there but I'm just gonna use them as like little tucks and gifts and goodies these big pom-poms were $1.99 and I actually looked in my stash I'll probably do a um, Christmas stash reveal again um, just like I did Halloween there he is hey Claude say hi to the camera little baby this is why my if you ever wonder what's going on with my hands I do not harm myself I get attacked by this cat he is well he was feral when we found him I mean we've had him since he's six weeks old but he's a hot dang mess he is just nope I'm just gonna try not to get him all riled up but these pom-poms I'm not exactly sure what I'll use them for I might make a tea in and use it as like a tassel just take some needle and thread and you know put it um, or a pom-pom paper clip or something like that there it goes ah no I love you why don't you be nice to me I love you 
Okay, so I'm just gonna let him go. He's he really he's just playing. You know, he doesn't have his litter mates to play with. No, don't don't full on attack me. Oh my goodness. So I should have brought a toy in here or something for him to play with. So here's the pom poms. Can we not please? Okay, so these are the little puffy wreaths, and I like these to use as embellishment for embellishment clusters or for cards. They are absolutely perfect, and actually I think I picked up four packs of these because I'm a crazy lady, but they're obviously just gold. You can use them with any collection. You can put them with Maggie Holmes. Um, you know, they're very versatile. You don't just have to use them for Christmas, obviously, so I'm not going to lie. I kind of put them over here so, so I wouldn't be shamed, but yeah, I bought four packs of those. They're only $1.50, so really it's a pretty good deal. Okay, baby. Okay, baby. Okay, so here are the little pom poms. These are going to be great to just stick on to embellishments or memory <laughs> decks cards. I see that belly. I see that belly. Okay, and I really like those. I like the colors. There's some that have like some gold uh, little things in there. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry that you're having to see his area. Okay, so these are just some stickers i only saw one pack of these at one tuesday morning and actually that's all i bought at that particular one and i'm sad to say that some of the girls at tuesday morning know me i go to i have about five that i rotate around to in my area and that sounds like insane but they're all within like maybe 20 minutes of my house at the very most so it's you know i live in a i live in uh, the northern suburbs of atlanta so there's lots of locations around me i have okay he's gonna okay Claude. Okay, let me get rid of him. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Stop it. Stop it. Be nice, Lord. What am I going to do with you here? Go play with that. There you go. Okay, so I am so sorry about that. It is, this is my life now with this little guy. But he, when he's sweet, he's so sweet. And he's really just playing. I don't think he's trying to be mean. He's just, you know, playing. He's teething. He's a little baby. Um, but he came into my life. I did not know I needed something to love until I got Claude and he has really kind of helped me come out of a depression since my mom died. So I'm very thankful that he's in my life, but sometimes he's a hot mess, but I just deal with it. He's my baby. I love him. And, uh, these are the packs of ephemera. This is probably what took me the longest time to find. I didn't buy all of them. There were still two packs left. I didn't want to be a total jerk. And obviously, I mean, I don't think I really need more than two packs. I only have one 12 by 12 paper pad and a six by six. But, you know, with the Happy Mail community, you always want to have some to pass along to your pen pals. I got two packs of these. Um, these are just die cut. They're snowflakes. And there's gold. There's, like, pink. There's a light peachy pink. And some blues with white. And when, once I bust into them, I'll be doing project shares and show you what I make with these. Claude is back. But he's being sweet for now. Um, so here's some of the snow and cocoa frames. I know I have one pack of these from last year. Um, but they're super cute. I think they'd be good for embellishments. And the one project that I had in mind, um, I, I want to tuck these in as goodies too. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's not kill me. Let's not kill me. Hey, hey, hey. No, no. Okay. So these are super cute and you get 12 of them. I think that's a pretty good buy. So like some are long, this one is kind of wider and these little ones are square. Super cute. I like those. There's going to be a lot you can do with these. You can layer up embellishments. You can layer up memory decks cards. You can put them in as goodies. Here it comes back. Here are some tassels. I bought two packs of tassels because they're only $1.49. And I feel like these will also go with main squeeze. So when, um, what do you call it? Valentine's. When you get on camera, you literally forget everything. You say, um, all the time. I swear I don't say, um, this much in my actual life, but it's especially when you have this going on, that there's constant distractions. He's probably going to run off with this, I, which I'm going to laugh if he takes that and runs off with it. He took my Swiffer duster and took that and ran off with it. It was really funny. So here's Snow and Coco tassels. I really like the colors. It's red, pink, and you know, like a turquoise blue. And I got one pack of, I couldn't remember if I had a pack of these or not. And I looked at my stash and I don't think I do. So I got one pack of the mason jars. I did see a lot of these and I was tempted to buy more, but they're $2.99. I was really trying not to go too much over 40 bucks. Um, but I think those are super cute. And obviously they're just gold and white. So you can use them for other collections, not just snow and cocoa. And the one thing that's not snow and cocoa that I 
did pick up as for Christmas because I want to do a no by November and a no by December since I have purchased so much in these last couple months and this is a little pack of dies I'm just gonna hold him this is a little pack of dies and they're tiny I figured these will be super cute for embellishments and memory decks cards and they're just cut and embossed Christmas theme and they're just really cute so you get this little a tree two reindeer and some ornaments and a little sentiment that says winter wonderland and I figured those would be cute and I think I'll use the tree the most and the little deer but for $4.99 you get how many pieces one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so you get ten oh no I'm sorry eleven pieces it says it right there wow and I think it's gonna be cute so I'll definitely be doing some project shares and show you what I make with these and let you know how they cut out but I'm actually gonna get ready to get started like today I'm gonna try to at least cut out some memory decks cards and back them up you know make them double-sided whatever I'm gonna try to at least get started today I have one Christmas swap due on November 14th but I have to have the sneak peek done by the end of the month to be entered to the giveaway and then I'm gonna do I think um, Shara Crane just posted a giveaway for a memory decks card and I haven't really made too many of those I really made the Halloween one and I've never made another one I'm kind of new to that so I wanted to get it done and I will be sharing everything. I'm definitely gonna do snow and cocoa because she said you can use any crepe paper. So I'm gonna do snow and cocoa and do the memory decks card challenge and I'll be sharing that when it's done. Thank you for joining me. I'm so sorry for the interruptions and I will see you in the next video.